auto wipe balance should never be used for interviews. You should always take a couple of seconds to do a manual wipe balance after all the lights are set and you're nearly ready to roll tape. While auto wipe balance is convenient, it's also prone to color shifts during the interview, especially under mixed light sources. When you do a manual wipe balance, you are matching the camera to the exact lighting being used and locking the setting in so it won't change unexpectedly. I've seen estimates that auto wipe balance on most cameras is wrong 80% of the time, and an incorrect wipe balance can be very time consuming to fix in post. But not all manual wipe balances are created equal, and often a manual wipe balance that was set using an ordinary white reference card or a piece of paper will give you colors that are just too cool. One very effective technique for getting a better looking white balance is to use Vortex Media's warm cards. White balancing with warm cards will shift the white balance to warmer hues so skin tones look healthier and the overall picture has a nicer look. In fact, the warm cards technique is an important part of the look of most of the major network news magazines. Warm cards come in four different strengths so you can control how much warming you think is appropriate, but once you've seen the difference, it will be hard to ever go back again to an ordinary white balance.